Uh, welcome back. Uh, Prairie OKC Tiny SS, a sour ale with, they say fruit candy, but it's Skittles. 5.9%. Uh, uh, me and the wife got a pour of this and a pour of something that was a stout with roasted peanuts and Ghirardelli dark chocolate. Uh, we ended up coming home with four of these. <laughs> Her choice. Yes. I just rolled it anyway. It's just what I do with sours. This looks a little darker orange compared to what it was on tap. Looked more a peaches color. More than likely it's going to be better because everything I've had that's on tap that goes to a crowler usually gets better. Like orange candy, like um, orange lifesavers. It's exactly like orange lifesavers. It's a little more tangy. It's tangier, yes. It's not as like... It smells more like orange life saver out of that. It's not as fruity. Like... Skittles type fruity. That's definitely good. Now I'm getting... Orange life savers. Or I guess it could be the Skittles in a way. It just... I guess they're kind of universal. I think lifesavers are more strong, like potent. Mixed with like a peach. There's no peach. Oh, no. Okay, yeah, no. I guess they just throw this fucking yeet it. Whole goddamn lot of them. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is Prairie OKC only. Um. My favorite Skittle beer that they did was the Vape Tricks with, I forgot what Skittle it was. They only did, um, I think, one keg of it, and it was no crowlers to go. It was all on tap. I was there, like, at opening. I must have been at least the second or third person to order it. Um, Is that the one that looked like dirty dishwater? I don't, it's on my Instagram. I, I don't know. Uh, but that was my favorite, and if they canned that, I guarantee you, they just say, we're, we're done making uh, standard vape tricks anymore. Okay. It is, of course, sweet. Um, it does have a little tart tingle. little weird kind of like dryness that kind of goes away pretty quickly because your mouth waters so much um orange heavy orange candy flavor super sweet i've had stouts that were sweeter and stickier though but it's still for a sour is pretty sweet and peach in a way peach pineapple possibly like the artificial flavors not the not like you know, getting mosaic kind of a hop notes or, you know, translate into like an orange or lime and nothing like that. It's, it's straight artificial candy flavor. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What flavors you get? Orange, orange. and anything Mostly else? orange. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out if there's anything else. But yeah, straight artificial. There's others, but it's like. Yeah, all, all fucking in there. Um, there's. One Skittles, it's a yellow bag, it's like bright side. Please, for the love of God, make a, make a, uh, a sour with those. Just look at all the, it's like kiwi and watermelon and other stuff like that. It's It sounds like I would buy out everything you had if you, if you made it. I guarantee it'd be good. Are you, gl are you glad you brought a four-pack? Uh, yeah. What do you give it? Ten? Yeah. I'll say nine and a half, only because it's just heavy orange and peachish color, or uh, peachish flavor. Mm. I guess that's what it tastes like. Maybe I need to get one of each of the Skittles and just eat them. But Skittles has lime, grape, 
Well, that's strawberry or cherry, one of the two. Kind of standard of Skittles. Were there standard ones? Yeah. I thought it was like the chocolate ones or something. Hmm. Just standard Skittles. Even the picture was just the standard Skittles. Mm -hmm. So, nine and a half, ten. Ten. Real good. Uh, I'm sure they still have this in the brewery. Maybe. If we didn't buy it all. Um, <laughs> they, they do this same release from time to time. So, if you're like, ah, oh, shit. It's two months later, and I, I could have had this. Just pay attention to them on Facebook and Instagram. They usually let you know three, at least two or three days beforehand that it's going to be coming out. Uh, typically, releases on Friday and Saturday, usually Friday. Uh, they'll let you know by Tuesday, Wednesday, what they're going to be kicking out. But typically, it's at least every two weeks they're doing something new. Almost every week. Sometimes one, sometimes two, sometimes three different beers. So... Prairie OKC, that's why I listed them as my favorite brewery, or not favorite, my most recommended brewery to visit if you're uh, in Oklahoma City area, if you're passing through, if you're living in the state, and up the road is Vanessa House, little mention there, so there you go, we'll be seeing you.